our audience probably knows you for a little film series called Harry Potter. Uh, <laughs> do you have a favorite awesome. memory from all this? I mean, I, you know, I made, I, they made eight films. I was in, I can't remember, actually five or six of them over the course of 10 years. It's a bit like saying, do you have a favorite memory of the 80s or the 90s? You know, I mean, you know, first of all, most of my memories are too X-rated to share with the public. Uh, and nothing to do with the making of the film. Uh, um, but I guess if I had one thing, I mean, my relationship with Tom, who I'm still friendly with, who played my son, you know, to know someone like I know my children from being this big to being this big to being this big to being a man and, and still be friendly and, and, you know, love him um, is great. But I think if I had to freeze frame anything, it would be the time that we shot the great big battle of Hogwarts in the, in the courtyard at the end. And it wasn't the filming of it. It was the fact that we couldn't film it. It was pouring with rain. And, and there were, we, in my memory, it was weeks, maybe it wasn't, but, but if we were shooting the film in America, everybody would have gone to their trailers or maybe not even come to work. But we're British actors, we come from the theater and everybody huddled in a tent by these gas heaters, drinking stale tea that the spoon would stand up in, huddled around the fire, uh, at the gas heater, and listening to Julie Walters tell stories about her pig farm and Jim Broadbent tell stories and, you know, Emma tell stories. And just, I was sitting with the people who were, maybe the greatest actors in the English language, you know, alive today. I couldn't believe that I had a front row seat that, and I prayed for the rain to continue. And that's one of my favorite memories. Uh -huh.